Welcome back guys. Today we'll show you how you can set up or add your new printing tab. Okay, let's get started. So from the Lumis dashboard, you click printing tab. Under printing tab, select add new printing. As you can see over here, we have a four different printing tabs, which is calculate price with text, clip arts, image, and upload. Secondly, calculate price with one colors, calculate price with size of area design, and price fixes. You can apply any of it according to your product. Okay, today we will go through one by one. As you can see over here, we have a printing titles, printing thumbnails, and description. So first of all, you need to give it a name first. Okay, scrolling down, you can see over here, the calculation price. So make sure you select it as yes. Allow set up price for each stage. You must allow you to add up to four stage refer as the boxes. And today our product will be a t-shirt, so we will have two stage. We got front and back, so I add one more stage. With each stage, you can set different price. So let me explain deeply all of these columns for you to understand. The quality range over here will be 1 to 5. For example, if your customer buy under or equal 5 products, this price technique will be applied. And you can freely change the price over here. You can easily add more quality range by clicking this one. Okay, let's do 10, which is 5 to 10 products. This is the way you can give your customer a discount. So just simply if they buy more, they will get cheaper price. So if they buy more than 5 products, for example if they buy 6 products, the tax only cost them from $1, now only $0.5. Clip ours as well, you can freely change the price in your ways and add quantity range more if you like, 20 from 10 to 20. And with the stage 2 as well, you can add quantity range and change the price separately. And making sure you select active and save the printing. So now I will go ahead to apply this new printing type for my product. So under product, you click on own products. And our product today will be main t-shirt. You click on edit. Scroll down to find the Lumis configuration setting. And click on it. And then you hit edit product base. On the detail tabs, put a check mark on the text printing type. So in the future, I will teach you how to create others printing type. So it will all appear here. You can easily switch to any of them and then save product. Update. Now let's go to check out product. Customize. So you can we can see the price over here, right? Okay, let's check it. For example, the customer buy only one. Is under five product so one text they add will cost them one dollar more so the system automatically add one dollars when the customer select it the product base price is 40 and one dollar for the text if they add one more it will one dollar each other with the clip art it works in the same way so in here we define one clip art is one dollar each other right now it's 43 40 for the product base price and one text, no, two text and one clip bars. Okay, let's go ahead to delete all of this and then buy more than five product, which is six. So now the product base price is $240. And now let's go ahead to set the text. One text, only $3. So the equation will go like this. The quantity multiplies with base price plus text price. Awesome, now we are going to create another printing type. So, as usual, you click on add new printing and then fill the printing type. So with this new printing type, we will calculate price with the colors. There will be different price if the product was full colors and one colors. So I will explain it. The quantity range is the same. So with full colors, we charge them $40. Um, 
and one dollars will be tamped with quantity range to 10 products we trust them three dollars for full colors and five dollars for one colors and then we select active set printing go ahead and edit product base so now you see we have a one more printing techniques select colors unselect text and save product update it and then view product customize okay so with this one okay i let you see the base price for you right so with this one which is three colors so the system automatically add four dollars to the product base price because it detect that this clip art have a more than one colors and it's understand that the customer choice the full color option so let's delete it and get this one which is only one colors so we set it for 10 we set it for 10 dollars if only one colors so that example for the quantity only one is under five in the quantity range so let's do six in the quantity range from five to ten so now you can see the base price is $240 right so I will put one colors which is one shape in the design so it's got me $30 more which is $5 for each colors because we have a six for that right you can check in the table here with the range from 5 to 10, one color is called them $5. Okay, next we will go through the calculate price with size of area designs. So I give the name first as size. Scroll down to select this one. Calculate price with size of area designs. So, so as always, the price you charge will be different. And you can easily add quantity range, more columns, and reduce the columns. For example, you will charge them $20 if uh, this product printing size is in A0 and $30 for A1. You can reduce the color as well. Okay, and then save. Edit the product from the mess configurations and select the size. You can both select three of this or select just one. So select between A0 and A1 depend on your product. I select the A0 for example for you to see and say save and then reload this one. Okay, so because I select the A0 printing side, right? So it will charge me $20 each chart. The place price is 40 now they charge me $20 each charge. you see that? okay last but not least the last print technique is price fixes so as usual we give it the titles and then check this on at yes if your product won more than one stage this technique works pretty same as all the types the difference is you don't calculate separately with clip arts or printing size okay let's do some math if your customer buy 3 products this is the way you calculate the price. The equation will be the base price plus excess price. All together, multiply with quantity. So for example, your customer buy three. I will multiply with base price is 40, right? Plus fixes price, I give it $10. So it will equal to 150. Okay, let's check it. Set the printing and then product base details fixes and save and did it and reload this one okay one two three here we go okay that is the last technique so if you have any question just leave on the comment our support will assist you and that's it for today thank you for watching